a very warm welcome to all viewers. It is Kaiser from Simply Learn, and in this video, we will be looking at the installation of UiPath. As you might already know, UiPath is an RPS software tool used for business and IT. To know more about the UiPath tool, you can check out our UiPath tutorial. In this video, we will look at the requirements before installing the UiPath tool. Then we will look at the different editions that UiPath offers for different users. And finally, we will install the UiPath software. But before we begin, if you love watching tech videos, then subscribe to our YouTube channel and make sure you press the bell icon to never miss an update. So let us see the requirements. We will first look at the hardware requirements. The CPU should at least have a processor of 1.4 GHz 32-bit configuration or it's recommended to have a 1.8 GHz 64-bit configuration. The device is recommended to have a RAM of 8 GB, if not at least a minimum of 4 GB. Let us look at the software requirements. If you are using a Windows operating system, then Windows should be of version 8.1 or 8.1 N or 10 or 10 N and the Windows Server should be of 2012 R2, 2016 or 2019 versions. Another prerequisite is to have .NET Framework of minimum of 4.5.2 version installed. Let us look at the editions. The different editions that UiPath offers. UiPath offers two types of editions. Community Edition and Enterprise Edition. Community Edition is for the developers and small teams who are just starting on their automation journey. The Enterprise Edition is further classified into three types. Enterprise Studio Edition, Enterprise Cloud Edition and Enterprise Server Edition. So Enterprise Studio Edition is for individual enterprise developers who want to experiment with UiPath Studio. Enterprise Cloud is a cloud-based deployment of entire RPA enterprise platform for any size business. Enterprise Server on-premises deployment for entire enterprise automation platform for large-scale business. Let us look at the different profiles in UiPath. UiPath Studio X, UiPath Studio and UiPath Studio Pro. UiPath Studio X is for business users. If you are not a developer but if you want to automate a simple task then it is easy to use a Studio X. UiPath Studio It is for RPA developers. Build complex automation that is run by attended or unattended robots. UiPath Studio Pro It is for the specialized developers. Automate with AI, advanced RPA features, testing tools and sophisticated coding services. So we will look at the installation. Let us install UiPath. Go to any one of the browser and search for uipath.com. This will take you to the official UiPath website. Here you can see try UiPath for free. Click here. Since I have already registered before, it is showing as continue to existing organization. If you are visiting this website for the first time, then you might have to register or sign in using an email account. After signing in and filling all the details, you can continue. Here you can see download UiPath Studio. Click on this and download the UiPath Studio. Here you go, the UiPath Studio setup file is getting downloaded. Once the UiPath file is downloaded, run the setup file and here you can see the UiPath is getting installed. After installation, it will ask for a license. Select Community License which is free. After selecting the license, you need to choose a profile. There are three profiles, UiPath Studio Pro which is the Advanced Studio IDE. It has features like testing tools, advanced RPA features and coding services. Another profile is UiPath Studio. It is for developers who have prior programming experience. And the last profile is the UiPath Studio X. It is for the people who don't have any programming experience. So we will select UiPath Studio X for now. Next UiPath will ask you to update the channel. 
you can either select this table version or preview version. We will select this table version for now. After you select the versions, you need to select the source control plugins. You can enable Git version control system or Apache subversion and Azure DevOps server. So, UiPath provides a short introduction video tutorials to learn how to build automations following step-by-step -step instructions and an academy to take free training on the UiPath Academy. So that's it. You have successfully installed UiPath Studio. From here, you can open a new project, new template and start building the first automation. If you have any doubts regarding the UiPath installation, put it in the comment section below. We will reply to it. I hope you liked the video. Please like, share and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Hi there. If you like this video, subscribe to the Simply Learn YouTube channel and click here to watch similar videos. To nerd up and get certified, click here.